bachelor, yet full of mysteries. Girl B, boundless and base of aerospace. Elsa, a long history, thousands of years old. Golden Desert is waiting for you. The Aksa Desert Global Geopark is located in the west part of Inner Mongolia, China. It is adjacent to the Ningxia Hui Autonomous Region and Gansu Province of China, and it joins the People's Republic of Mongolia in the north. The total planned area of the geopark is about 600 square kilometers. It is the only desert-dominated geopark in China. In Mongolian language, Aksa means a colorful land. The lofty Hulanshan Mountain, extending 250 kilometers from the southwest to northeast. Lies on the southeastern margin of the geopark and prevents the invasion of the Baden Jaren and Tanga deserts from the west. The large-scale uplifting of the Hulanshan mountain started in the Eocene about 53 million years ago. Complicated geological structures and specific geographic position make the mountain an important boundary to divide East and West China on geological structure, geography, climate and desert and non-desert. The Aksa Desert is the general name for the Baden Jaren, Tanga and Ulaanbaatar deserts. They are located in the arc form desert zone in North China. The total area of the Aksa Desert is about 96.9 thousand square kilometers, about 15 of the total desert area in China. Geologists tell us that the Aksa Desert started to form in the early Pleistocene, about 2.5 million years ago. The information is mainly controlled by global climatic fluctuation and the uplift of Qinghai Tibet Plateau. The geopark is a natural laboratory to study desert origin, evolution and control in China. It is also an ideal site to understand the uplift of Qinghai Tibet Plateau and global climatic change. The desert is a mystical place. The boundless and amazing Yellow Desert has attracted more and more brave explorers to enter the interior of the desert. The Baden Jaren Desert is the second largest desert in China and the third largest desert in the world. The Baden Jaren Desert began to form in the early Pleistocene. Now it has become a vast sand sea. The densely distributed high sand hills make about 61% of the total area of the desert and were arranged in the northeast direction with an average elevation of 1,300 to 1,600 meters. The Belud Peak might be the highest sand hill in the world with an elevation of 1,609 meters a relative height of about 500 meters. It is called the Mount Everest of deserts. Once on the top of this peak, you will be surprised by the magnificent views on the lake and desert. The Baden Jaren Desert owns the largest sounding sand area in China, about 160 square kilometers. It is called the Kingdom of Sounding Sands. Sliding down from the sand hill, you could hear the sound roaring. 
The mystery of the sounding sands has attracted a lot of visitors. The normally accepted supposition about the sounding sands is a resonance hypothesis. After the long-term rework by wind, water and chemical corrosion, numerous small pores occur on the surface of sand grains. When the sands roll down the slope, these small pores will become a lot of resonant boxes. The resonance will increase greatly and could be heard far away. Underground water resource is abundant in the Baden Jaren Desert. There are 108 springs exist on a stone of only 3 square meters in the center of the lake. The spring is clean and sweet. The Tingjing Spring in the Suming Jaren Lake is an amazing one. The water will gush when it is caught and stops when you stop calling. The Tanga Desert owns the maximum number of lakes compared with other deserts in China. More than 400 lakes like sapphires embedded on a vast desert. These lakes might be the remnants of a big unified lake before the Holocene. After the climatic change and strong evaporation, the big lake has been divided into many smaller ones. The beautiful and magic Moon Lake is a good example of the lakes in the Tanger Desert. Here is the desert exploration camp that is nearest to the metropolitans in China, equipped with the best reception condition, service facilities and tourist items. The sand surfing is surprising and exciting, and the camel back tour is leisure and enjoyable. The windy effect has created not only the vast desert, mellow sand dunes and elegant sand ripples, but also various magic canyons and stone forests on the exposed rocks. The Aulambulage and Urbugai Canyon groups are developed in the Jurassic rocks, resulted from earlier flowing water erosion and later wind process. These canyons are winding, with steep walls. They look like ancient castle of over 1,000 years. The high Centrulu stone forest is developed on Jurassic diuretic granite and shaped by wind effect. Here is the typical area to study wind effect in North China. On the rock walls, there are a lot of caves in different sizes carved by wind, and the isolated erected stones were modified into various lifelike shapes, such as mushroom-shaped, legend-figure-shaped, and animal-shaped stones. The Alxa Gobi is generally black. Under the bright sunshine, the vast Gobi would display a colorful mirage view. The rare Alxa precious stones are the gifts of nature. 
These stones are derived from the cooling of volcanic lavas about 80 to 100 million years. Through a long geological time, these remnant hard materials have changed into a variety of precious stones. The Juyanhai Lake is a terminal lake on the Heihe River, which is the second largest inland river in West China. This lake is an important place for resting and breeding of migratory birds. During the migrating season, there will be a great number of various rare birds in the lake. The popular diversifolia forest in Nurjian is one of the three primary popular forests in the world, covering an area of 220 square kilometers. In the late autumn, the popular forest will display its most beautiful scenery. It is said that the popular trees will be alive for thousand years and keep erected for thousand years after death and will not decay for thousand years after falling down. The dead poplar trees in different styles are still standing in silence, telling us a historical story of great changes in this area. Aksa has a profound history, and the unique Juyan bamboo slips of the Han Dynasty record the important political, economic and military events at that time. The ruin of the Red City of the Han Dynasty, 202 BC to 204 AD, the Datong City of the Sui and Tang Dynasties, about 600 AD, and the Green City of the Xixia Kingdom, 1038 to 1227, are still standing in the vast Gobi, showing their once glory and resplendence. The ruin of the black city built in the Xixia Kingdom is the best preserved ancient city ruin on the ancient Silk Road. The religion in the Aksa areas is mainly Tibetan Buddhism. The Guangzong, Fuyin and Yanfu temples are the largest Tibetan Buddhism temples in the west part of Inner Mongolia. They have prevailed for nearly two and a half centuries. The Badin Jaren Temple is a sole temple built in the heart of desert. The architecture of the temple is magnificent and dignified, which is called the Forbidden City in Desert. The blue sky, yellow sand, temple and green water constitute a perfect and harmonious picture. The specific geographic position of the vast Auxa has created a unique folk culture. The vast desert breeds a valiant Mongolian nomad. The local people safeguard silently the desolate and vital land. And they have made great contributions to the stability of the north frontier of China. The Hirshot and Tuohat are the two large Mongolian clans. 
which have lived here for many generations with very unique minority culture and customs. About 300 years ago, the Teal Heart clan has experienced many hardships and difficulties to come back from Russia. They wrote an immortal patriotic epic with their blood and life. In 1958, the righteous Alksa people moved out of the pasture they had lived for many generations, and it was turned to be the China Dongfeng Space City, one of the three largest world space centers. Since the successful launch of the first man-made satellite in 1960s, 49 satellites and 9 Shenzhou spacecrafts have been launched there where it has created 10 milestones in China's space history and realized the Chinese nation's dream of flying into sky. The Tsekka port, situated at the Sino-Mongolian border, is a perennially opened inland port, which is an important gateway to other countries to the west of China. The transportation system in the Alksa Desert Global Geopark is composed of national, provincial and tourist highways. The nearby Yinchuan, Jiayuguan, Wuhai and Dingxin airports and some railways forming a modern three-dimensional transportation network. Here is the desert world, here is the life paradise, and here is the charming wonderland and civilization oasis. The stalwart desert life is freely bursting into bloom, and the various desert landscapes are magnificent and attractive. And the unique desert culture is charming. The loud and melodious horse head bowed string instrument is playing. The Mongolian sonorous song is singing. The good wine and beautiful dancing and holy harder present to you and wish you all happiness. Shut sure.